everybody, and welcome back to another episode of RimWorld Illithid Inn. Now, I may have a little bit a little bit of difficulty talking today. I got a, a sore on the side of my tongue that very irritatingly brushes against my teeth. Quite the pain in the ass. So, uh, I get it's been a weird time for uploads lately. And I want to clarify, that's because... Uh, my mobile hotspot on my phone, that's the source of all my internet, is totally, like, bonked at this point. Uh, my phone does not let me upload anything using my mobile hotspot without tanking the battery. And on top of that, it's just been a lot slower in general, so... I'll, I'll make this work somehow, but you can expect uploads are going to be a little bit slower. I say, as some episodes have been as much as three days apart. In any case, we've gotten into Illithid. My favorite part of this series is when uh, Alexander said, you really are the Illithid Inn. So, you want to know what just happened to me? I, li I like, just woke up. I fell asleep in my chair, and I had a dream with like two major plot beats. Oh my god, I forgot about the stool. <laughs> the first one was that they put uh, Makima from Chainsaw Man in Skullgirls, and I was apparently rather hyped about this. Guys, I have not watched Chainsaw Man. I don't know who this woman is. That said, though, a new Skullgirls character in 2024 would be pretty cool. Just saying, like, Lab Zero Games? You, you guys get on that. You know, what are you doing? Making webtoons? They were good, but still. Uh, the other part... I was going along this uh, highway near where I live... And so I'm walking with like my friend and my sister and I'm explaining to them like, okay, this is how you stay safe on this highway when you walk alongside it. Uh, sometimes the cars swerve off to the side, so be aware of that. You know, there's some rocks in the way, don't step on them. Also, there's normal dogs and zombie dogs, and the zombie dogs usually leave you alone, so, you know, like, don't worry about them too much. But, like, the normal dog, eh, watch out, you know, he's kind of, he's kind of, kind of rowdy. And I just wake up sometimes and I'm like, what did you mean by that? Like, what did my brain mean by that? So I also did uh, a private play, not a private, like a personal playthrough. And uh, what I discovered, food, food's not the go-to. That's not, that's not the way we do it, man. It's logging. Logging is the money maker. I did this on my personal playthrough. I was swimming in fucking cash. The drugs are here. 37 smoke leaf candy. So, what we're going to do is we're going to stockpile a little bit of cash. I uh, hope the food shortage ends soon because that settlement was making money. Oh, okay, so there's no food shortage. The prosperity is just down. Okay, so hold on. We'll bump this down to 138. Slave plantation for 20% food production. Um, oh, shit, here's the thing we can do. Special actions. We can issue a tax break. 
This goes plus two happiness per day. Hope they get their happiness and their prosperity back up. The other drug trade comes in four days, so... Yeah, here we go, he's, uh... We're trimming the smoke leaf. Maybe we should sell some drugs that are not horribly addictive and, uh, kill people. Ahem. <clears throat> Ahem. You know what, though? This is, like, this is handling our markets, because after... After people are, uh, going through their skooma and opium withdrawals, they're gonna want some weed to, like, calm them down throughout it. Care for your clients' needs at all stages of their life. That's my, that's our motto here. At Illithid Inn slash Industries. That's clever. Inn is also short for Industries. Because we're a company and a business and an empire. Who just left this out here? Oh yeah, I did. Probably for good reason. Fuck, man, where do I put this? Alright, we'll put it in here. Okay, saunas are done. Now, I'm gonna make less mistakes. I say as I place the unstable power cell in my wooden house right next to everybody's bedrooms. I'm going to make less mistakes, he says. Uh, what I was going to say, I'm going to save up more money before I start this next settlement so I have the cash to actually fund it, get it all kitted out, and the new settlement shouldn't have any of the debuffs. So the ideal... The ideal loadout... We're gonna want... We're gonna want a barracks first. What is being built here? Oh, I think that's just a uh, destroyed building. We're gonna want a barracks, uh, logging production, a tree farm. Anything that boosts logging output. Okay, so, also, as our reputation improves, you can claim a bed, right? Uh, guests will actually bring more silver to spend on goodies that we sell them in our base. Which is nice. If we look at, uh, Deus Dead over here, You are at seven silver. It's also carrying uh, moon sugar cane. Taxes build, so we actually lost money on that. So, what we're gonna need here... We need a good skooma crop. A good moon sugar uh, outcome. And we're really gonna need to sell that all as quickly as we can, so... Yes, that, I believe that caravan that left was the last one that Fran called. Uh, the mercantile trait wouldn't hurt either. Thing is, if we wait long enough, uh, our prosperity will return to normal. And we'll start making money again. The only issue is, uh, money not invested in more settlements is money wasted. No two ways about it. Oh, adult entertainment center. That's what we were building. 
We're up to 25% happiness. 59% prosperity. That's a little bit better. Their state was okay. It was okay. Buddy. Buddy, I didn't bust my ass for this long for your stay to be okay. We can do better. We can do better than very impressive. We can do extremely impressive. We can do better than slightly impressive. I didn't come all this way. Alexander didn't leave his home to be second rate, okay? We are not Ramada Inn. Dare say it, we are Holiday Inn. That is the one I chose for the thumbnail. That is literally just an actual Holiday Inn. Yeah, party. Uh, it's good you guys are having mood buffs, but it really does me a lot better if you're working. If you want, I'm not a complete monster, so I'll let you have your fun. Look at the stool. He's happy. So you know what uh, I really think somebody should do? Somebody needs to do Vanilla Vehicles Expanded Battletech. Which, if you don't know Battletech, it's like Warhammer for even bigger nerds. And it has a lot more, uh giant stompy robots like imagine if titans were the main thing of warhammer then you'd have battletech i just i want to do a mech playthrough and that's not because i bought hairbrain schemes battletech and mech warrior 5 within like three days of each other because i'm on a huge battletech kick right now I just have these, I have plenty of ideas for series. And if uh, Illithidin keeps progressing at their colossally slow pace, we may see those sooner than expected. Doubly so with the upload snafu. This series has really kind of dropped off, but I do, I do like it. I do want to finish it. A difficult one for me, though, is being is constituting what counts a finished series. The military force is two. The attacking force is one. It should, that should, that should be fine, right? Corn good. Uh, statues wouldn't hurt either. I did install the quarry mod. Purely because I was worried about running out of resources. So actually, I could get one of those down if I, if I wanted to. Let's take a mini quarry and we'll throw it right here. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I I don't know why we didn't just give Fran a peg leg. Who's the other doctor? It's been a long time. Outro. Outro. I'm just gonna call you A. Missing two times medicine. Never mind, friend. You know what's funny? Like my private playthrough. Things are going so good, it's like I forgot I didn't cheat. I was like, 
damn, you know, I've just got so much money all the time. I have so many settlements constantly producing me crap. I don't have enough shelves to hold my mortar shells. And this one, it's like, hmm. Another crumb of steel, please. Please, sir. I want some more. Literally some ore. Oh, get to work, you two. You know what? The mining, the mine mod would have been way better. Because you can directly mine steel, or silver. Which is really what we need here, is silver. Come on, mine all that... Mining. Harvest all that opium. 24 skill, 52 opium. That's not enough, buddy. Half the skooma has spoiled. Why? The skooma I don't know. Only two of it has. Okay, that's not a big deal. You know what I think's funny? We have Roscoe. This mercenary vampire. He shows up to our colony like, Yeah, I'm pretty good in a fight. Pretty good at bludgeoning heads. And we're just like, Hey, that's great, man. Like, you're a vampire. You're pretty good at busting people up. You got a very strong back. You're efficient. Can you just clean and haul stuff? Like, that's really all we need. I know you were a child spy and a policeman, but... Now you're, like, a day laborer. Alright. Speaking of Roscoe, this guy's a little peckish. And get, get our two big guys in here. Hold on. Now that's intimidating. Or at least it would be if... Oh my god, is Scorpion blushing? Dude, don't make this weird. He's just gotta eat, okay? I was going to say, at least it would be intimidating if Scorpion wasn't incapable of violent. We have a tailor bench, right? I was going to say, let's get Scorpion some clothes, finally. I don't know how that works with the big and small mod. I don't know how we would go about getting him clothes. Is there like a big tribal cloak? Because I'm kind of realizing he's been naked this whole time. Well, it's tattered apparel. I was going to say, we don't care about tainted apparel. We are trying to be rich, but that doesn't mean we won't exercise some spendthrift every now and again. Prosperity is slowly going back up. Oh, the settlement is under attack, of course. Scorpion, buddy. Take a rest. Frame will get to you in a minute. Smelly? I don't want to hear it. Both of you rest. Defense is successful. Awesome. It's about time. We are still not profiting. If anything, we are making less money. So... Shit, I think... I think it may be more fruitful. 
if we were to just put down that next settlement. Well, no, because that's going to have an upkeep cost. Here's what we'll do. We're going to call this caravan. We're going to pray for a good uh, skooma yield. And we're going to hope it gives us the money we need to finance that next settlement. Logging settlement. That is the key to money. Okay, so Smelly. You might become a vampire if we're not careful. Which, I mean, I guess wouldn't be the worst thing in the world, but, like, you know, more mouths to feed in terms of hemogen. That, that wouldn't exactly be great. God damn it, we may, may actually have to set up a hemogen farm. That's not what we farm here. We don't farm blood, we farm drugs. We're not monsters, after all. Alex is a master of cooking now. Well, if nothing else, Alex's food is going to be no. This is going to be somebody's favorite, like hole in the wall inn and restaurant. And like, guys, guys, you have got to try Illithid Inn. Like, the food there is amazing. Like, yeah, but there's that, like, really big scorpion guy. And he's, like, a little too friendly, and he's kind of creepy. You know? Let's see. It would solve nothing, but we could make him, like, a hat. Oh god, if Scorpion really has been walking around naked, that's like... It's amazing that people have been putting up with us for that long. We got like a Ravager armor. We need 180 leather, so no, no, we cannot. A tabard? Hey! Maybe we need to diversify a little bit. Start branching out into new products. He can't equip weapons. Well, somebody's gonna wear this goddamn thing. You, Lucretia. Tabard. What is this, the TSA? Sorry, sir, but that, uh... That tabard you're attempting to wear, uh, it's considered a weapon by our guidelines. Can't let you do that. Ooh. I got so used to Tech Priest Retro, I see somebody whose name starts with R and ends in O, and I think it's Retro. I saw a guy called Nero, and I was like, is that is that colonist, that random person who showed up named Retro? That would have been wild. I, I should add myself to name and game. Honestly, you ever see some of the names that are just, like, recurring? Uh, I see... I seem to see Sissy a whole lot. 
I don't know why, I just do. Oh boy. Oh, that's not good. Oh, damn it. It's a raid. I got complacent. I forgot these things happen. Apparently not at home, anyway. What the hell are you... Why is everyone wearing berets? Can I just make a mod pack where something doesn't become weird? With the punk? No way! Weirdness is a when, not an if. Yay, visitors! Fokushiba. Only two of you. Did we get a bad Yelp? No, three. I was gonna say, did we get a bad Yelp review or something? Because I feel like we really, uh... Kind of lost... You don't have a weapon. Why not? Why do you not have a weapon? Guys? Whatever the hell this uh, outpost is called has fallen. Ugh. Rest in peace to the Courageous Fallen. A cougar. I don't suppose you mean the kind from Florida. Shoot it. You attempting to like full auto fire a musket? There was actually a musket that had like a fairly automated mechanism. I forget the name off the top of my head, but it could fire like 60 rounds in a minute, you know, like not that it always did. I don't know if it had ammo capacity for that, but that was the rate of fire. Bolt good trader, please fund my empire. Okay. We are not, we are never, ever parting with the animated stool. I can tell you that right now. What if I sold all this corn to you? You, you have like no money. Okay, um... Is there anything we want to buy from them? Let's take the loot boxes. Sell them all of the opium. I'm not even going to question why you have Ratkin subject me. Alright, that's about all we want from them anyhow. The silver, and the loot boxes. Nineteen loot boxes, that could potentially change some things. The silver, 
may yet be enough to start us up on our logging colony. Wow, that was hollable. You just weren't doing it. Oh, is that serpentine? Well, we've got 2,690 silver now. Nice. Let's found a new colony, for the love of God. Food production here is 1.5. So is animal production. It's 1.75 for wood? Holy shit. And what we're going to want to do here, we're going to want to settle that. Zoom in and on research. Everything else, drop everything else. We want road building. That is actually killer. Uh, we do need a little more money. We can start bringing some in, though, and then the deficit will pay for itself. As long as we're making money elsewhere. Any, uh, deficits we have at other colonies, they'll just be paid for and deducted from our taxes. You know, I know they say video games are a bad influence, but honestly, what other game could get you excited about taxes? Ignore my opium farm, please. That is, um, not important. Good, so we're cash flow positive already. Some of the uh, barracks here. Let's see, and are we going to be able to afford the logging camp? Deforestation camp, we're going to want that. Okay, so we wait for that to build, and then we're going to start making money again. All this bullshit poverty nonsense is going to be over. We're going to have a 334 silver income. Every time. And we can forever remember this as the series where we sold pot cookies to samurai. I'm just realizing, Alex has the anime protagonist hair. Like, he's one set of dark lines under his eyes from the I Get Bitches haircut. Yes, admire my, my dining room. You love it here. You guys love it here. It's great here. You guys will love it. You'll love it. It's great. We can make a sauna, too. We can make a bathhouse. You know, though, uh, this is going to be completely unrelated. But I do just kind of want to throw a bunch of these down sort of beautify the place. Look a little better, it'll fit in. The reluctant monster. 
Okay, Nikolai von Imhoff, a, su a suspected monster, are on the run from a hunting party sent by Samawara clan. They're already hostile to us. So... Might have been up to monstrous acts. Ask, acts. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Welcome, Vaughn. Incorporate. Oh, this could be cool. Uh, you're a good miner. You're a good medic. And you're decent at crafting. You've got passions in both combat stats. And you're a masochist, which means if you're ever feeling that too... If you're ever feeling down... We can just beat you up, and you'll, be, you'll feel better. Alright, and you guys... Uh, it says you're attacking immediately, right? So, what do you get? Yeah, just the usual combat squad. We can get you guys over here. Oh shit, yeah, trade caravan. Nice fucking work, guys. Oh, my, my drug tithe is here. Okay, they're waiting till the map's clear of danger. So, what we're gonna do here... And Vaughn, come with us. Uh, Tem, come with us. Walk back this way. Oh! Damn! Good shot. And that's the thing, once we have some money from other settlement ventures, we can start funding more uh, obscure stuff. Like random bullshit we want. Scorpion, no. More obscure stuff we want to do if we want to uh, start what, manufacturing weapons. Start manufacturing medicine or drugs. Hey, goods received. 52 smoke weed cookies. What the fuck are you? Jesus Christ, dude, I don't open this often, because it's like a... What in the fuck? Voice of God. So you can't do any of these things. I, I gotta see your xenotype. You're ageless. Archite metabolism. Indestructible apparel. non senescent Perfect immunity, scarless, herbivore, half Jotun frame, slow bleeding, Eltec synchronization, mystic warrior, very unhappy, heat immunity, cold super tolerant, fire immune, dead calm, giant weapon wielder, no pain, delicate, concussive resistance, ever fertile, no libido, never flirts. What's the point of that then? It's like having a car that will always work, but you can't drive it. These look good, I like them. Move on. Wait. Oh, the stool buried the body. Did 
this is this is odd on many levels. Just a little bit strange, you know? Manifest Concord of Yuzia. That's like the visual protagonist being named Yu. Like, why you? Which is apparently something that happens more than I thought. Ant's Royal Court. You any good? Not really. Roscoe, what are you unhappy about? Sunlight sensitivity and genetic depression? Damn. That's rough, buddy. Um. The dislike. What the fuck do you mean, disliked food? Look, go eat a smoke weed cookie. You're gonna death rest soon anyway. Are you incapable of anything? Firefighting only, okay. Idealision forbids. So, we need a conversion ritual. That's what we need. What is the point of this fucking ritual? That's why I feel like the ideology stuff goes so underused, is because the cooldown is so long half the time. Alright, if we could get you guys to start chopping trees... Just uh, waiting for that next tax period. Using a major break risk is it Vaughn? It's Vaughn. Hey, another bolt goods trader. Awesome. From the Central Republic, no less. We've got loot boxes to open. So, Alex, while you're doing that, Artro, lucky man of the day, come on down. So, we're going to sell you. We're going to sell this Psychite tea. Sell this Moon Sugar. All of you stupid traders are all broke. Oh. buy from you. You don't sell components. You do sell cloth and Tyrion, which I guess I can use. More loot boxes. Oh, I can't afford them. Or can I? Getting into ill-advised territory here. However, we did trade with them, so you know, that's a boost to relations no matter what. Let's see... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, could be butter, ice. Great must, crushed granite, smoke leaf leaves, hay, wasabi, toxic potatoes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 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 nine. just to be safe. So that's an ovum. 
empty gene packs. Uh, step back. Let's take a look at this. Fertile Cobra eggs. Wake up. Raw rhyme no nodules. Adrenaline. Poor Skuma. Wow, doing our work for us. And Alex, go open these. There's a gas mask, a hundred, one thousand five hundred and seventy four smoke leaf seed, hydromorphone. Yeah, it's about what I gathered from that name, a drug for greatly reducing pain. In the loot box, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Ooh. More smoke leaf seed. A ZM car. Black powder that said deteriorating. I thought it said detonating, and I was like, oh god. Run, Alex. Some s steel. Bad and brandy. Hemp flower, some yayo, one, two, three, four, five, fertile goose eggs, fertile tortoise eggs, milk, diamonds, you guys could haul all of this, uh, Tem, Actually, don't haul these. Yeah, just uh, leave those alone. What am I supposed to do with an ovum? I don't think there's anything in it. Fucking Alexander's just some, like, random illithid from a medieval kingdom. He doesn't... He doesn't know what all this fancy cloning shit is. Yo, dude. Careful with that black powder, yeah? That's a lot. Okay, so actually, I want you on cleaning and hauling as top priority. You guys aren't stuck in the home area or anything, because this stuff just isn't getting hauled. We won't rush you there. Let's see, how is our, uh, our settlement doing over here? The barracks are done. Okay, military. Automatically defend attacking settlements. That's the important one. Because these are close to each other. They'll jump to each other's aid, and we can uh, actually defend stronger... Stronger attacks than either one could alone. Accept this for goodwill. This is a series about guests and catering to people. Let's see, Fran, if you would. And actually, oh my god, I completely forgot. Alex, trade with these bastards. Oh, it's okay, you didn't have medicine anyway. Oh, but you've got money. Why do you have money? But don't think about it too hard. Oh, wait, no, we're gonna need that component back, and we sold it. No, no, we still have the component. Okay. So, friend, um... 
Actually, before you do that, I think a lot of our meals rotted in storage. Get replacing that component. We don't have a lot of those. You have the same hair as Fran. However, you never see it because Alexander got her a very nice hat. Because that's like an old timey thing to do for your wife. Taxes build! Estimated attacking power is four! I can't win. I can't! Well, at least the military from the other settlement is going to come here. Grand, for the love of God, please. Taxes have arrived. Cool. Yay. Guys, please try... Please, haul this expensive stuff I spent a lot of money on. We need more shelves. Well, I just so happen to have a bunch of empty room. waiting for that defense successful. Please, defense successful. Not much we can do now except sit and hold our breath. Copy these settings. Paste these settings. Cleaning's now not getting done. We don't have steel. Is that logging camp getting done? Moreover, is the settlement under attack? We haven't even used these fucking tadpoles. Because every time we do, whoever we use them on becomes incapable of doing most work. With little to no benefits. I just want to see this finish, man. Come on.
Please, I want money. I'm so broke. This settlement is under attack. Oh yeah, 10 days for the tax break. Okay, so we're really just not going to get anything out of here. Not soon, anyway. Uh, for a faction overview... No, the defense is going to be successful. Assuming the military aid came... We're defending... That's a lot of fucking chickens. So let's see. Chick one, that is male. We don't need you. Keep you. Keep you. Yeah, we'll keep you too, because you're female. One silver. Oh joy. I'm holding my breath while I wait for the settlement siege to end. What do you guys like anyway? Oh my god, oh. And also, Roscoe, buddy. There's one thing I'm rather excited for in 1.5 is the clean room function. I'm sure there's all already a mod for it, but like... Why was that not base game from the start? Like, that just seems like a... still making money. And you know what? We're gonna keep going. Okay, where's the uh, logging camp? inspired trade God damn it I thought this was gonna finally be the one where we're like oh yeah we got everything sorted out now we're doing good I think desperate times are calling for desperate measures here If you're unhappy, here. You know what, you guys? I could benefit greatly from all the work you're doing. But since you have to stay happy, I'm just recreation all day. All day. Uh, Fran, can you handle? We really need you to take care of these chicks. Let's 
Sorry, small chickens, but there's not enough food for all of us in this world. Scorpion, what the hell are... Roscoe, what the hell are you doing? Oh, you're finally hauling all that crap I wanted you guys to haul ages ago. I'm a little concerned about this, I'm not gonna lie. Alex, now is not the time! Who's not burying people? Oh, you two. Why is it whenever somebody's upset, it's always you two? You know what, Alex? Get out of the shower. I'm gonna do something I should have done a long time ago. Wait, can you... Not in Thrall Vaughn? Why? What about Roscoe? You should not have either of those things. Wait, can Artro- does Alex have the max number of thralls? Is that the issue? No, that's just apparently broken. Yeah, incorporate his hair color. There you go. Eat a corpse, dye your hair. That's, I'm pretty sure how that works. Oh, thank you guys. Thank you. You're finally getting around to cleaning. Thanks. When cleaning gets ignored, settlements falter. income is very meager at the moment. I really should have gone with Expansionist. That is just the best trait. Because expanding is actually how you get ahead in this mod. go just grow tons of opium let's grow tons of it Dear little colonists. You guys are kind of fuck-ups, but it's okay. We're getting there. It just takes time. It's 
also means though that our faction is going to level up really slowly. Which sucks because I want the mercantile trade. That essentially just guarantees us a caravan every three to five days. Let's see, uh, shit. Please just build another shelf. Put all those meals in there, yes, yes, yes. At least the skooma trade's going well. Should've made Alex a specialty cooking. What's his expertise? Oh, he is... <laughs> that is his, co his, his expertise. It's his cooking speed. He is pretty damn fast. Your expertise, on the other hand, needs to be crafting and drug making. You guys just gonna leave that ovum sitting there? Get fertilized. Can then be implanted in a mother to start a pregnancy. Or in a growth fat. Um, well, he's sterile. I'm gonna do some weird science here, okay? Oh, that I don't like the implications of that. Um. Oh God, fucking damn it! Undraft, undraft, undraft. Undraft. You, Tonegawa. No, you can you can stay. Damn it. Finish <laughs> off the cougar. And Fran can call a trade caravan. Awesome. Now, um... Oh. Oh, we don't have... We don't have anyone who can mother Scorpion's surrogate child. I, I, I would think we do. No woman can be a surrogate. Well, guess we'll need to research a growth vat. And then we can grow more giant scorpion guys. Gotta say, though, this is probably the happiest colony I've ever been in charge of. I'm the least dysfunctional, and the least addicted to drugs. I won't say most moral, but you know, if you want to go through my series and count the, look, count the uh, retro war crimes and see which colony is the least evil, 
Somebody do that someday. I would like to see. Maybe when I have more series. I've got a few more coming up. There's one I have in mind. And that would be hilarious if that was like the worst one. But honestly, right now... It's probably Admech. Admech has probably done the most terrible things. And you know what? Fitting. Fitting that the Admech, uh, from the grimdark universe of the far future, have done the most bad things. Okay, uh, we can go get back to archaeology as well. This should just have a forbid option, so I don't need to go through and suspend all the bills. Wait, no, we do need to cook. No, Alex is doing exactly what he should be doing. not a huge deal that there's a material shortage because I wasn't foolish enough to bank on uh, weapons or apparel crafting. I was, however, foolish enough to bank on food production. Settlements. Uh, events. We've got 819 coming in now. Hey! That sounds like money, don't it? Drug trade in 20 hours. Military cooldown in 20 hours. Missed supply delivery. Oh, right, that's what that is. Okay, that's not a huge deal. I'm sorry, did you just cook, like, med medicated booger and fungus? Saute. If I have any means to eat a mountain lion with weed butter and fungus, I don't know if I would do that or not. Don't bother butchering them, man. You just gotta pluck them and do them whole as chicken nuggets. Okay, we might have to call a few more. What else can we do with this? Okay, yeah, bulk trim smoke leaf and then make smoke leaf hash. We can make hash oil, but we don't have chem fuel. I don't know why I accentuated the second words there. Ivory scrimshaw. Gold crown. That's a relic of ours now. That's Alex's crown. We're never going to get through all the smoke leaf. A war merchant. Would you like to buy drugs? Come along now. Oh boy, would you. Well, sir, do I have a deal for you. You can have all of this skooma, all of this wake up. Oh, you don't, you don't have a lot of money, do you? Oh, that's unfortunate, buddy. Really is. Um. Well, you really don't have a lot of stuff I want. Sure, some jerky, I guess. Uh, 
Take this hydromorphone, this adrenaline, and we'll opium until we get all of your money. It's okay, I'll drop the price by one silver because I'm a charitable guy. Let's haul this silver. Yes. Okay. Then he can go death rest. <clears throat> and we can start putting money back into our settlements. Now you... Manifest Concord of Yuzhia. I would like to give you back your barracks. And you? Well, you're already doing okay. Oh? Guys, she is almost cash cash flow positive again. We're going to make 800 silver every tax period, assuming nothing goes wrong, which it always does. How do we upgrade you for 2,000 silver? Oh, we are almost out of the hard times. Almost. Oh my god, man. You know, guys, I'm starting to think maybe the real Illithidin was the friends we made along the way. <clears throat> Look at all these colorful characters. And the leading man and woman themselves. We should make a bunch of apartments at our, uh, at our settlements. Fill the lore. You know, I like these chickens, but nobody's ever going to replace Bobo, the chemically brain-damaged chicken, from uh, God of the Dead. we put sculptures in the bathroom? This is pre-smartphone. Do we want them to be able to, like, admire something while they take a shit? I'm gonna hang on to that sculpture. Probably just sell it. How many smoke beef, smoke beef buds do we have? 54? Uh, we can make some smoke beef hash. There we go, we should have it like this. That way you only trim smoke leaf insofar as gets you enough to make some hash. There we go, military cooldown, and now we've got two drug trades, or three? I don't know. Scorpion, are you even good at art? No, why are you doing art? You're not supposed to be doing that. Forty psych IT, awesome. Why do we have a bunch of like mythical creatures as our citizens? We have a fucking charge rifle. you also. Uh, so... Artro, go run and pick up that charge rifle. What's your shooting? 10? Yeah, you, you get the charge rifle.
Also, no mercy and no respite for the enemies of Illipidin. Okay, okay, maybe a little respite. Maybe a teeny tad bit of mercy. Just for me, though. Like I said, no mercy and no respite for the enemies of Illipidin. Go on. Go on, you've done wonderful today, Artro. Like that guy has the same hat as Fran. Fran, as a noble woman, it's your right to complain that someone else has the same hat as you and that you would like a new one. It's gonna be a while before you can call the trade caravan. We're nearing the end of the episode, anyhow. Would like to finish road building first, though. Things got a little messy today, but you know. We've got visitors. He's also got the same hat. God damn it. Alex, you don't even shoot, though. Oh yeah, you do. You have nine shooting, but you we don't want to get rid of your illithid staff. Makes me miss the kitchen to see impids. You know... Like, the kitchen were just like cooler impids with an oni vibe. And now, uh, next episode we could expand the base a little bit because we got plenty of wood. we really don't have a whole lot we need space for. Hey! Barracks has been constructed. Like, how long are we holding these guests for? But not, that, not those guests, these guests. 14 days. We need them for 9 more days. These guys are going to be here a while. Oh my god, I forgot about this. See, did anyone make Art of Fran? This work depicts Zane Scorpion Modane, strutting his stuff without any clothes on while confused animals look on. Scorpion is fondling a shrub. Three finches appear to the right of the main scene. The image somehow expresses both decay and victory. This portrayal refers to Scorpion walking around naked on the 11th of September, 5501. There is a lot to unpack there. Let's put it in the guest room. <laughs> there you guys go! Hold on, Fran. Fran, please install this in their sleep. I'll wake up in the morning like, what the fuck? What's the art on this one? Scorpion made it. He... They're carving statues of each other, guys. Portrayal of a bomb. Portrayal of a cliff. Ancient... 
of Artro... Oh my... What is wrong with you people? On this, on this sculpture is a representation of Artro Cassell, mindlessly removing his clothes and sweating uncontrollably. This depiction relates to Artro being poisoned by toxins. Frankuva... There's repelling an invasion. Oh, bison. Unconscious bison. So knocking unconscious of bison with an RSC SMG. A palm tree. Remember that blue statue in there is a depiction of Scorpion naked. Working on the Edo production research alone at his bench. Stingray wearing a duster. Who is Stingray? Oh, a Stingray. An archer flying through the air surrounded by terrorists. Solitary Fletcher covered in innards near a prairie. Adding surface deal t detail to his... This is so meta. It's a sculpture of him making a sculpture. What are you guys doing? You guys are all like a bunch of weirdos. Taxes have, have, have arrived. 692 silver. You'll love to see it. It's cash flow positive, guys. Oh my god. We we need like eight hundred silver. We're making money finally from settlements. Oh, thank the maker. Dirt roads have been finished. Let's see. Go to location. Upgrade town. We need 3,000. Oh. Oh. Finally. It only took, what, five, six episodes? I love you, Blam the Animate Stool. Well, guys, that is where we're going to end off the episode for today. So, as always, if you like what you see, you know what to do. Uh, wherever you go and whatever you do, I hope you have a great day. And as always, I realize I said that twice, I have been Retropunk, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.